The Prince of Wales has been meeting service personnel ahead of deployment to Afghanistan. He went to Salisbury Plain to see soldiers from the 3rd Battalion, the Mercian Regiment, take part in their final training exercise before heading off to theatre in March. Charlotte Cross was there. The welcome was certainly warmer than the weather as the Prince of Wales arrived at Beach's barn on Salisbury Plain. Three Mercians are here in the very last stages of training before they deploy on Herrick 14 and the soldiers were given some time out to meet their Colonel-in-Chief. The Prince was particularly interested in the sheer amount of personal kit the soldiers now have to carry on operations. He was a bit amazed and uh, he, he said that he was very proud of all of us and that as well. So. Um, to have royalty say that to us, it's, it's a nice thing to hear. The Prince was shown some of the firepower the soldiers will be using in theatre and the Prince was also interested in more intimate pieces of kit. Yeah, he was cracking a few jokes he was, he was talking about thermal underwear and that, so that was quite amusing. Put a smile on everyone's face. You, you think he's going to be really, I don't know, um, hard to talk to but he was quite easy to talk to. He, just like talking to a regular, regular person so yeah, he made it quite quite easy for us to speak to him, yeah. This is the first time three Mercians have deployed to Afghanistan and once in Helmand the battalion will be split up, each company filling a different role from working with the Afghan army to operating out of warrior fighting vehicles. C Company who are here today will be operating under the command of a Danish battle group up in central Helmand and around 200 soldiers from the battalion will remain behind in Germany making up the rear party. I think uh, it's that fine balance of the excitement but a bit of uh, trepidation. Uh, for many it is their first operational deployment. Uh, for a number of us that have had the benefit of previous tours, then obviously it's business as usual. Finally, there was just time for a formal photograph before the troops went back to their training. Charlotte Cross, Forces News, Salisbury Plain.